What's up guys, this is Biz, and welcome back to the final episode of my 100% playthrough of Atmospheric Extinction for Doom 2 on the Ultra Violence difficulty with Fast Monsters Enabled. Technical info on the Watt and UV Fast Rules should both be popping up at the bottom of the video right now, so take a look. Uh, we finally made it to the end. This is the final map in the set. I hope you guys have enjoyed this one. I really liked it a lot, and I will definitely be keeping an eye on Velvetic's work in the future. So, uh, yeah, without any further ado, let's get right into it. This is map 9, The Land Beyond. Let's do it. Alright, so the final of Atmospheric Extinction, let's go. In case you haven't noticed yet, uh, the WAD author definitely has a fetish with punching out pinkies. <laughs> this is a timed arena where you gotta punch all these guys out. And uh, I was trying to do that, but it is so easy to get cornered by the turbo pinkies. So I just decided to do a little circle strafing, punch out where you can. Don't worry too much about it. And uh, we'll just wait for the bars to open, and then we'll come back to this area later. There we go. Nice doors to the big castle. like to grab the SSG and just come right on back down here and then take care of these guys. This is definitely safer than losing a lot of health right at the start and or, you know, dying. Might not be faster. But the other nice thing is, um, you can pull all these enemies that would be up here on the stairs down to the bottom. And uh, then we have a real nice, easy fight here. Normally, these uh, revenants are all spread out and they've got elevation on you, which makes them particularly annoying. This method is pretty good, they'll just trickle right up. Ooh, got hit from behind, I think. Want to pull them kind of down into this uh, purple pit over here. There we go. All right, one more. So this, uh, this is a two key map, we need to get two keys and then um, we'll go to the final battle. Pretty straightforward, it's kind of long, but uh, it's got this really awesome looking section here. Make sure you remember to step backwards to pick up the plasma. The revs in here are scary at first, but once you kind of know where all the triggers are, it's no problem. There's plenty of cell ammo in each of these cubbies, so don't be shy about using it. the plasma gun. Some green undies there, pick those up. And again, with the revenants, you gotta remember that when you're a certain distance from them, they will try to punch you and not shoot rockets, so... I just kind of stand close to the cubby, and it's all a kind of feel timing thing for when they get close. One final Archie here. Ooh, big miss. And uh, yeah, kind of got turned around there. Let's head out here. You want to push across, grab the cells, get right over against this wall. There are some skeletons up here along with the mank you buy. And I was really hoping to get a little infighting, but the skinny boys never showed up. Oh, there they are. Alright, lots of goodies here, but there are gonna be some enemies that teleport in when you grab the key. Ooh! I tried rushing the Archie, but we got zapped. That's unfortunate. 
kind of relying on a pain state there. Ooh. Give me those rev rockets. All right, we're looking a little rough, but there's plenty of health out here in the main area. Or in the entryway, I guess. And now we'll go this way. A lot of enemies down here, so take care of this skelly first. And deal with all these guys. Again, lots of plasma, so just let it rip. There are a couple revs here, so we gotta be careful. We don't want to eat another one of those. Oh, <laughs> okay. All right, time to get serious. You don't want to poke out here too far. There's an arch vial and this little cubby. Don't really need the shells, but we'll definitely take that rocket launcher. Another Archie over here. All right, there are some spiders up here, so be a little careful. Ooh, boy, health is getting real tight here. That's kind of a shame. Do I grab this med kit before we grab the supercharge? It does spawn a couple revs. And let's hit the switch to spawn in an Archie. Oh man, that's twice. No pain state. Oh well. It is what it is. Just push through here. Take care of the hit scanners first, and you can deal with these guys. Couple skellies down here. Oh, hoo -hoo, face rockets. Oh man. Highs and lows in this run. Again, red key booby trapped. There's an Archie there, but you have just enough time to come down here. We're gonna pull everything right here. It's just a beautiful spot. You can get the monsters to help you out with the arch vial. And you shouldn't resurrect too much. Let's grab that armor, why not? Okay, and that's both keys. We're heading to the final fight. Let's do it. This one's a multi-phase fight. Uh, the nice thing is, though, you can kind of go at your own pace. So it's going to be a lot of switches like this. You're going to want to hit them. This first phase, not too bad. We definitely want to clear off one of these teleporters here. There we go. Don't be afraid to use the BFG. Got lots of ammo. There's plenty of power-ups here as long as you don't get too reckless. Nice. All right, let's grab some goodies. Probably want gonna want to grab a mega. Well, I guess I went for the supercharge and the mega armor. All right, now this one's pretty tough. You want to come right over here. There's a lot of arch files here. 
Oh, there they are. Definitely want to take care of that arachno. Once he's down, we can start working on the Archies. Oof. Yeah, there's like four of them, I think. This fight was really about finding a nice spot with some cover towards your back because as you progress through these phases in the fight, the walls uh, in the arena all lower, so you get less and less cover. All right. Now this one is going to be pretty interesting. We just want to wait for these walls to lower. Do as much damage as we can and then hit this switch. Oh man, lots of damage there. And then uh, if you hit that final switch, that exit to the arena opens up and we can get out of here and we'll just uh, cheese the rest of this fight because there's no way we're doing a big wide open arena with a bunch of arch files, a spider mastermind, and a cyber demon on fast. It's just not going to happen. So. There's not enough health in the world. But once you can get out of the arena, you get a nice little funnel here where we can just kind of pull everything back. This is a great area for fighting. There's lots of health over here. Um, the only thing that kind of sucks is there's not a lot of ammo, but we got 72 rockets and plenty of cells. And once this cyber's down, It's going to be pretty easy here. The Archies are going to make their way towards us. And um, we're just going to rocket everything down. Now, let me just note one thing here. You got to be careful. You see this, uh, that little archway there? That's actually um, not solid. So this thing right here, you can, that I'm inside right now, this little piece that juts out. Uh, you got to be careful because enemy projectiles will go through there and you can get sniped pretty easily that way. So, something to think about. It's just knowledge of the arena. Okay, one enemy left. Who could it be? Who could it be? I got my plasma ready for you. Boom, he's down and that's atmospheric extinction in the book. The land beyond... Map 9 complete. I just missed the part time by two seconds, but that's okay. This is a fun map. Uh, not Definitely not the toughest one in the set by any stretch. Um, but, uh, you know, it's a good fight, and I definitely had some fun figuring out a strategy for that final phase. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this wad. I sure did. I'm going to be keeping an eye on uh, any future work from Velvetic. This map set was beautiful. And the gameplay was pretty fun. I'd encourage all of you to go check it out. And uh, yeah, stick around. More Doom content coming. UV fast style. You know how I do. We'll see you guys next time.